Welcome back now to Decatur.com. It's another 10 question Tuesday twofer, this time with a pair of St. Teresa Bulldogs. We got Brianna Niebergi and we got Kate Heiss. Ladies, you ready for this? Yeah. <laughs> All right, head coach Todd Voland. What are some of the nicknames you have for him? Um, definitely have to go with Tater Todd. Tater Todd. <laughs> Another popular one's um, TiVo. Yeah, you guys calling this in front of him, or is this like all behind the scenes? Oh, no. <laughs> no. Behind the scenes. It's Coach, it's Coach Voland, Mr. Voland. Never. Sir, I assume yeah. all those. Okay. Speaking of Coach Voland, uh, who's got the best impression of Coach Voland? I'd have to say me. All right. Yeah. All right. Flippin' Pansy, you gotta be faster than that. Let's go. Flippin' Pansy, really? Pansy's uh, his favorite word. Pansy, yeah. Pansy's his favorite word. He says it all the time in class too. Alrighty, uh, Kate, I'm gonna come back to you. Uh, there's a video out here. Who dances better with your brace on, uh, Vanessa or Kita? We've never actually seen Kita dance with it on. She's a good dancer, but I'm gonna say Vanessa just because we have a video of her dancing with it on. But they're both pretty good, so. What's it like to be a bulldog? Oh my gosh. Um, being a bulldog is like seeing a cockroach everywhere you go on the stairs. <laughs> everywhere you walk, there's a cockroach on the floor. Other than that, it's, it's pretty great. I love being a bulldog. Cockroaches, huh? Is, is this all truth, ladies? Really? Wow. What's the record seen in the day? Like, how many do you see on average? Oh, like four or um, five? Yeah. Ooh, different I've, places. Yeah. I've definitely seen like seven or eight in one day. Different places. Yeah. They're, they're, and they're never alive either, though. They're always they're like, dead. They're on their back and their hands are like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so disgusting. Do that again. Do that again. That's what they look like. <laughs> Uh, Brianna, we'll start with you. Uh, what's on Pubs you up before meets? Um, I'd have to say Don't Let Me Down by the Chain Smokers. Chain Smokers. Yeah. That's a first for me. I like this one. All right, all right. Kate, what do you got? I don't really listen to a lot of music before meets, but normally Keith is like dancing. Sometimes it's like high school musical, like we did at our last meet. But like whatever she's listening to normally pumps me up because she's got pretty good taste in music. So. Whatever Keith has got. I like it. I like it. And, uh, and Brianna, what goes to your head whenever you're running the 400? What, what, what's, what's your jam? Okay. Um, I sing Barbie Girl in my head whenever I'm running the 400 because my steps just go right along with like my pace and the 400 goes along with that song. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Kate, we'll start with you. Who is your celebrity crush? Um, he's not super popular, but his name's Douglas Booth. He was in like a 2012 version of Romeo and Juliet, and he just played Pride and Prejudice and John Zombies. Who you got for me? I'm gonna have to go cliche and say Ryan Reynolds. What about him the most? What, 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 what makes him dreamy? Oh, I don't know. He's got nice eyes. I like his eyes and his hair. It just, just all goes together. Just the eyes and hair? That's all right. That works. All right. Gotcha. I'm not being clean about it yet. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, Kate, uh, I've seen on Twitter here and there and maybe on Facebook too. You like to draw. Uh, sorry. What do you favorite? What do you like to draw the most? Lions. I honestly have no idea why. I love the Lion King. And so it's really the only thing I can draw, like not just from memory. I can just sit down and draw them. So I draw them pretty obsessively. Uh, any hidden talents for you, Brandon? Um, people tell me I can sing. Okay. So, yeah, that's... You sing the national anthem once, right? Uh, yeah, I, I sing it all the time, actually. That's uh, oh, okay. I remember this now. All right. So well, give me your nerves on that. I mean, can you bust out a Jose, can you see? Okay. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light? Wow, that's pretty good. Uh, who would be the best wingman for you? Um, I'd have, I'd probably have to say either Keita or McKenna. They both got my bag. Okay. I'm, I'm usually Keita's wingman, so uh, <laughs> I mean, the time I uh, tried to set her up, it didn't work out too well. But I, I think I think she'd have my back if it came to it. Listen, they're not all perfect games. It happens, all right? Yeah. You gotta keep trying. You gotta keep trying. All right, Kate, what do you got? This is gonna sound super cheesy. My kind of stop looking at me. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say all of them because I tr I would trust them all oh, wow. with about it. Okay, yeah. okay, fine. I choose Anna. I do. All right, and the girls may chime in here too, but which school not St. Teresa has the best looking guys? Ooh. 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 Um, man. Ooh. 
Yeah. I'd probably Mount have Zion. to say Mount Zion. Mount Zion? Mount Zion. Yeah. Mount Zion's got that win. <laughs> Mount Zion's got that win. Yeah. All right, tenth question. You bubbles me without throwing up. Good work there, Brianna. Good work. Good work. Uh, to question, uh, touch on celebration time. Uh, you got some, some, some girl stuff here too, but what do you got for me right now? All right, uh, we did this before every basketball game and it seemed to work pretty well for our wins. So um, this, this is what we got. Who's better at whipping, you or Central A&M? <laughs> Tune in next week for another 10 Question Tuesday. Watch me, watch me, watch me, watch me.